If your Steam Deck is stuck in a boot loop, don't panic. Understanding what's happening is the first step to fixing it. A boot loop means your Steam Deck is repeatedly trying to start, but failing to complete the boot process. You'll see it getting stuck in an endless cycle of restart attempts. Boot loops typically stem from corrupted system files, failed updates, hardware issues, or incompatible modifications. The good news is that most cases are software related. Here's the encouraging news. About 85% of boot loop cases are software related and recoverable, with a 92% success rate through proper troubleshooting. The solution is Recovery Mode, a special diagnostic environment that operates independently from the main SteamOS installation. Recovery Mode is your lifeline. It runs separately from the corrupted system and provides diagnostic tools, repair options, and reset capabilities. Now let's learn how to enter Recovery Mode. The process involves a specific button combination that you need to perform correctly. Step 1. Ensure your Steam Deck is completely powered off by holding the power button for at least 12 seconds. This forces a complete shutdown. Step two is the crucial part, entering recovery mode using the correct button combination. Hold the volume down button, then press and hold the power button until you hear a chime. This specific combination boots you into the recovery environment. Once in recovery mode, you'll see a menu that you can navigate using the volume buttons to move up and down, and the power button to select options. You'll see a menu similar to this boot manager screen. Use the volume buttons to navigate and the power button to select recovery options. Remember, power off completely, hold volume down plus power until you hear the chime, then navigate with volume buttons. Recovery mode is your gateway to fixing boot loop issues. Now that you're in recovery mode, you have several options to fix your Steam Deck's boot loop. We'll start with the quickest solutions and progress to more comprehensive recovery methods. Your first option is boot from disk image. This is the quickest solution and can often resolve minor corruption issues without any data loss. Simply select this option and wait for your Steam Deck to attempt a normal boot. If the quick boot option doesn't work, you'll need to perform a factory reset. This completely restores your Steam Deck, but will erase all your personal data, so only use this option when necessary. To perform a factory reset, select Reimagining and Recovery Tools from the Recovery menu, then choose Reset to Factory State. You'll need to confirm the data loss warning, and the process will take between 45 to 90 minutes to complete. If Recovery Mode itself fails to load or work properly, you can manually re-image your Steam Deck. First, download the latest SteamOS recovery image from Valve's official support website. Next, create a bootable USB drive using tools like Rufus on Windows or Belena Etcher on other platforms. Select the downloaded SteamOS image and your USB drive, which should be at least 8 gigabytes in size. Finally, boot your Steam Deck from the USB drive while in recovery mode and follow the on-screen instructions to completely re-image your device with a fresh SteamOS installation. Following these recovery methods properly results in a 92% success rate for fixing Steam Deck boot loops. Most issues can be resolved through software recovery without needing hardware replacement. Remember to start with the simplest solution first, boot from disk image, then progress to factory reset if needed, and finally, manual reimagining as a last resort. Most Steam Deck boot loops can be successfully resolved using these methods.